We begin tonight in East Hampton, where responders spent the day searching for a missing jet skier. Welcome to Western Mass News at 6 on this Memorial Day Monday. I'm Matt Satilli. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey now joins us live in East Hampton with the latest. Olivia. Yeah, Matt, crews have packed up for the day and the boat launch is back open. For those of you unfamiliar with the situation, this was the second day of the search for a missing jet skier that state police believed to be a 51 year old man. Our crews were present for a search yesterday in South Hadley. The jet skier was involved in a crash with a boat in Northampton Sunday night before 7 o'clock on the Connecticut River. The two people in the boat were rescued by environmental police and transported to Bay State Medical Center in Springfield. Multiple local police and fire departments, state police, and the Massachusetts Environmental Police have been searching for the person for most of the day. To aid in the search, police are using side scan sonar equipment to feed back images. If anything is detected, divers head into the water to investigate. Now, despite this search, boaters I spoke with off camera told me today on the water was pretty quiet. Be sure to stick with Western Mass News on air, online, and on the Western Mass News app for the latest details. For now, reporting live in East Hampton, Olivia Hickey for Western Mass News.